Okay, uh, hi guys. Uh, just a quick um, painting bench video. Uh, I just finished the Safavid uh, Zinbarek battery. Uh, the so these are camel mounted uh, light artillery. Um, just finished doing the base, so the glue is still drying, but um, they turned out. Uh, Okay, I guess. I mean, really, well, the problem is this primer I bought, um, which some of the other figures, you can kind of see the texture um, didn't really go on smoothly, so it kind of had an effect on the figures, but um, yeah, it happens. Um, and I'm hoping I can use these guys f also for... Well, they're from the Safavid range from Khorasan, but I'm going to use them also in the Ottoman army uh, just as a light artillery unit. Um, the Ottomans use these kind of kind of camel guns too. So, um, and I, I went ahead and based them together on uh, one of these Warlord 40 millimeter bases. Uh, I think that'll work just fine. Um, and I'm hoping maybe I could get like three of these to make like a kind of like a battery almost. I think that would look really cool. Um, so yeah, those guys, we're going to finish these guys. I did try to do highlights, which is kind of my weak point with painting. Um, let's see if we can fix the lighting here. Um, yeah, that's not so good, but uh, yeah, highlights are kind of my weak point in painting, so, um, yeah, not, not the best, but, uh, anyway, I'm trying to get an army painted, that's kind of my goal, um, and also I did more work on this, pol the Polish infantry, so, um, I've got, uh, I finished another stand of these guys the other night, um, and they're, they're coming along okay, um, yeah, I think they'll probably look better, from a distance anyway, so, um, and then as you can see, I've got more going on, uh, the tents, I still kind of want to do some, like, dioramas, maybe, some, like, mini dioramas, so, um, I might check, like, on Litco or something, if they have, like, a, maybe think, like, a 60 by 60 millimeter base or something, I can make a little diorama and get maybe some, like, other figures for Ottomans or, or Poles and have as like camp followers, something like that. Um, or, you know, maybe like a general's tent that would look pretty good. And, uh, yeah, I've got, uh, still got a lot to do. Um, you know, just a busy time of the year for me, probably I'm sure for a lot of you all, uh, as well. So, yeah. And I think, um, as far as my next painting, uh, I'm definitely going to go to the hardware store and just get some cheap uh, black spray primer or order maybe some of the Vallejo uh, spray paint because that stuff is really smooth. But, um, I mean, even just regular hardware store primer is fine because uh, this stuff, um, yeah, this stuff I got from Michaels is not good. I'm a little disappointed, or it wasn't from Michaels, it was from Hobby Lobby, and it is this acrylic spray paint, and I showed it on a video before, and I, you know, it's acrylic, acrylic, it says acrylic resin, and, um, yeah, uh, you know, which I thought maybe that the I thought it would be like the, the Vallejo spray paint, but I was sorely mistaken. And, uh, as you can see, maybe, uh, the, it kind of doesn't go on evenly. So that's the issue. And these guys, I think will get, um, just get some regular black spray paint. If I can maybe get, get to that this week. I don't know. We'll see. Um, yeah, I'm really, I, I think I'll, oh. Oops. 
I'll be pretty happy when I can get these these guys, these archers painted for the Safavid Persians. They'll look really good. Uh, some Tajik archers. Um, and uh, have another, another group of Janissaries that'll look really nice. Yeah, so I, I think uh, like a lot of this year has been kind of, for me on the hobby wise, has been kind of branching out into 15 millimeter and I'm, I'm pretty happy so far. Uh, and, and I'm, I like, um, kind of what you can do in the scale. So, and I think if I keep building and painting, I'll have two pretty sizable, uh, armies and, um, yeah. And, and I think they'll look good. Uh, well, really three, if I keep buying Safavids, uh, because like I said, you can, some of the units I can kind of cross over to Ottomans. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's what I've got going on. Um, my painting skills kind of, uh, you know, I haven't been as consistent painting wise. So it's been, my kind of skill has gone down, but also, you know, these are 15 mil and, uh, have more detail on them. So anyway, um, I hope you guys like the video, um, and, uh, I will, uh, talk to you guys in the next one, um, and thanks for watching the, uh, the hist history videos, I, I hope you found those, um, informative, and, um, and, I, and I'll keep, keep trying to make them, um, I prefer to do just like reading the sources because I think that's sometimes more uh, useful and and more interesting than than doing like video essays, which I don't really think are a good format. Um, but anyway, that's kind of a different topic for a different video. Okay, thanks for watching, everyone, and um, I'll talk to you in the next video.